This is our Christmas decoration in our toilet. As you can see, it is decorated by my brother. Oops, stop now. So you've been the light, so that's the mirror. Shh. And this is my room i know it's, it's not that as fancy as the toilet one because the cable wasn't that long enough um yeah but it, it looks like a smiley face in it it's simple because i like i like symmetrical shape and um i like neat and tidy yeah so that's i know it's, it's, it's quite boring looking but i like it that's my type and if you see outside even our neighbors have like a nice one. See that not neighbors is quite nice, nicely done. Um, the reason I'm recording this video is that um, I think I have got something special to. Sorry, mate. Yeah, to unbox something in this video. Just give me a second. Let me just switch on the light quickly. Um, I have received a package from NHS, as you can see. Okay, so by the way, NHS, NHS is a um, national health service in here in the UK. So it provides like all, all the health services here in the UK. And so this is something related to my blood donation. Okay, so let's do the quick unboxing. Yeah, by the way, like Christmas is coming soon. You know, today is what, 16th, so it's about eight or nine days left for the, for the, for the, oof, oof, oof. Okay. So first is this, it says, thank you. It says, thank you, dear Mr. Guru, for being a dedicated donor. You have now reached your 10th milestone. In recognition of this, we would like you to present you with your first donor badge and certificate. Your commitment as a blood donor has helped to save and improve lives of patients in hospitals around the UK. We look forward to welcoming you soon again soon. Your sincerely, David Rose, Director of Donor Experience, NHS Blood and Transplant. Yeah, because um, last like two weeks ago when I donated, that was my 10th donation. Um, I have been I started my donation like on, um, I think it was about 2016, yeah, 2016. So since then, I have been donating like every May and December, like two times a year. Okay. Um, okay, you may ask why I start donating. Um, because from like, okay, so let me show you something. Can you recognize this? See, like it's something like that. See that because I am from Nepal, yeah. And like 200 years ago, British Empire tried to conquer Nepal, but they couldn't. So instead of fighting for against us, they employed us. So we are known as Gorkhali. Actually, not me, but my great great grandparents because they fought for the for the for the land. So. So for their own, for their bravery and courage, British Empire hired us as soldiers. So my dad, my my granddad, they were all in British Army. So in a way, I'm I'm very I'm very grateful that I got chance to come in this beautiful country, England, and I've been living here for like last fourteen years now. Time flies. Um, so I'm just grateful, and I just want to do something for the society. Um, three years ago, I tried to join RAF, Royal Air Force. Unfortunately, I couldn't because even though I passed everything, like all the initial like recruit training, everything, passed everything, everything, but at the end, when I went for medical, I fell because my eyes, they're like very bad. It's not only the power of the eye, but the orientation was like very shit yeah so i couldn't do it yeah so 
so this is the way I to show I appreciate and um, I also like to thank um, Joanna Lumley and her team because without her and her team we Nepalese wouldn't get a chance to be here in the UK so I'm very grateful to her and her team and to the UK government yeah so this is my way of saying thank you even though before I die I want to do something you know like maybe build a school or like do something crazy but at the moment I'm still a employee and I'm still you know like financially struggling so so maybe one, one day once I be financially free or uh, yeah you know yeah so that's my that's the, that's a big plan yeah and so there's like another leaflets I don't know what is this about and this is something there see that number 10 actually my favorite number is eight but this one is ten oh it's the small bats see it says, says number 10 so I'm gonna put that here right next to my oh, oh sorry mate uh... can I do it yeah by the way all, all my all my videos are like raw because um I'm not a video maker, you know that, as, as, as you can tell, all, all my videos are raw, because that's how I roll. Okay, so that looks cool, bruv. Look at that, that looks cool. Can you see that? Number 10, bruv, number 10. And there's also a side fake here. It says, thank you. Wow. I am a 10th donor. I'm a ten donor. Every donation counts, and it's just blood transfer. In recognition of your amazing generosity, thank you. I might. My eyes are getting teary now because. Okay, before I cry or like tear falls down, I just want to start this video. Yeah. Um. Yeah. I'm a bit like emotional person. I, I want to do something for for people, for human for for human race. Yeah, so it's my tenth one. Um, I will never stop donating until something happens. And I also try to look for the pallets. It's like a, whenever you bleed, it will the it will stops. So it, it will clog the blood vessel. So Actually, I don't know fully, but because whenever I go to blood donation, because normally for me it takes about like 40 minutes, but there are like some other like experienced people behind me, they donate like pallets. Yeah, I think that's what you pronounce. Um, and what I know is that for those one, no, I, I, I did some research to, to be like pallet donor, but what I found is I am not eligible because my blood group is O plus and for that one you have to be either A, B or A and B plus or minus so I'm not qualified yeah so I, I, don't, I, I don't want to make this video long yeah so in summary I'm grateful that NSS recognized my contribution yeah but I'm more grateful to the UK government for letting us like Nepalese here in the UK Okay, before I go, I just want to say Merry Christmas in advance. Annyeong. Onjebutoyinji <laughs>
the 1st December 2018. Um, so I'm just coming out from the blood donation center shooting St. George's Hospital. So this is my sixth donation. I feel good. The reason why I donate blood is that because before I die, I want to be a useful person. I want to help other people in need. And like Tony Robbins said that the, sec the secret to life is giving. All right. Could I'm sorry,